Hi guys and welcome back to this YouTube channel. I'm your host Muheshimiwa Bendawa. Thank you once again for joining us. Thank you for showing your love. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for sharing our content. Thank you for supporting us. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So on today's video, it's like the previous one. Uh, we just uh, need to have a conversation whereby uh, um, it's unfortunate that I don't have uh, another person here so that we can be discussing this, uh, these questions one by one uh, so that it don't seem to be biased. I don't want to be biased, uh, but uh, I'll be giving my own opinion uh, regarding the questions. But uh, you can check through commenting down below or maybe giving your opinion on the same. So we will be having uh, some few questions here and there. Quick first, I'll be giving my opinion. You give your opinion since we are a family. Natunaishi hapa Kenya sisi wote pamoja. So let's go direct the questions. Number one, ladies, uh, ladies use their body to climb corporate ladder. Sijui kama hii ni ukweli, but uh, according to my opinion, to some extent, yes. To other extent, no. Unajua kuna ladies, they have their own dignity na morality yao iko juu. So we cannot generalize and say that... Uh, Maybe they were not given uh, those jobs uh, according to their qualifications. So I believe uh, each lady or a person, whenever you are given a chance uh, to, to lead a certain corporate or to be uh, an employee in, an, in, a, in a certain corporate, you have those qualifications. But however, there are those ladies uh, maybe I would say 30 percent who uses the Dukayao <laughs> they use their body to to rise the corporate ladder. Maybe mtu alikuwa secretary, akakuwa sijui, akapewa cheo igine, akaanza kupada pada hivo, mpaka akwe manager ama CEO wa hiyo kampuni through kulala na my managers na nini na nini. So it's a very unfortunate state of affairs. So you should change. Haya, tupe opinion yako venyewe unafikiria. Imagine wanaume wagekua wanapata periods. Ladies, why do you think ni kama we don't go through difficulties? I know uh, kupata cramps na kupata hizo ma period pains ni inakuwa tricky kwa wasichana wengi eh, especially those uh, those I think 4 days 6 days I don't know those days na for men we don't take it for granted na atutaka get kuwa dharau pia atituseme ni kama mnajifanya we know you go through a difficult time but uh, I'm imagining sasa mwehesh akiwa na periods. <laughs> si hata tukikuwa tunakojolea ukuta, tunaandika jina na ukuta ya, ya hizo madam. Guy. But men have a tendency of uh, at naonaga kwa ladies wakisema hivyo. At men have a tendency of exaggerating their pains. Hmm? So unapataga mwanaume <laughs> wanaume unajua mnakuwa tricky sana wanaume. Mwanaume ako karibu deathbed amegojeka kabisa. So anaamua acha yule mrembo wake ama ampigie in one way or another maybe amejua kumgojwa so ana come through kum visit nini nini kumwagalia but these men, in any way, fear men, watakula, they, are, they end up eating 
instead of recovering. I don't know whether that one is the medicine, but uh, what do you think, guys? <laughs> so, wagiku had in a period wagiku had a chill bad. So unethical. Anyway, men, respect yourselves. <laughs> uh -huh. Imagine, no, are, are there men who are abused by women? Yeah, there are. Yes, wako. Kuna wanaume hapa inja wametadikwa sana na wives zao, but hawewezi sema kwa sababu eh, the, the whole, the society will judge them. So una imagine nimetadikwa na my mamas ama mama for that case. Nimetadikwa, nimenyoroshwa. Nime then I decide to go and take P3. <laughs> Nikifika pale karao kitu ya kwanza nitawekwa ndani. Niulize uko na kichwa mzuri au 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 kaanza ti imekuramba hivyo au kaanza ti unapigwa na mwanamke. So inakuwa uh, hii society yetu bado haijakubalisha ile ile situation ya ati mwanamume anaweza report uh, any abuse. But I would encourage men Talk to your fellow men. Wabie kimeumana. Kimeumana. Na you can't hold. Ama siyezi, 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 siyezi eh, ishi na an abusive woman. Na if it takes you moving out of that marriage, please do. Eda, toka kwa your marriage. Quick, fast. Eh, usiku ya kafukuzui. Watraki ukue labistic shit. Uh huh. I think it's all the measure. No, I am remaining with two. Men, do you beat your wives? No, that one is past. Uh, Kitambo, we used to have those uh, like discipline cases whereby you are even encouraged to beat your wife by the society. But nowadays, mm -mm. If you are seen abusing a, a woman or you are seen pointing a figure to any woman, kita kuramba sana. Utaigia pale jela, utaigia pale maximum prison, utaigia pale kotini na hakuta kuwa na huruma. Kwa sababu, we must man up. There are better ways of solving a problem. Uh, not through violence. So, for that one, I don't think uh, men nowadays, unless he's a drunkard, uh, whereby nowadays uh, women, please be ready to walk out from an abusive marriage. Usikai pale unapiga pigwa, that toxicity in a lead to your death. No, 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 no. Just walk out. Just go. Uh, if you had a chance to leave this country, would you? Quick, fast. Haraka sana, haraka sana. Hapa kime, kime umana hapa, hapa Kenya, maneno iko vibaya. Hapa Kenya, you all know how the cost of living iko. How vile watu wanateseka hapa Kenya, we are trying to survive left, right and center. So, if given a chance, nisikia green card imeivana, nisikia o, oh, kuna mtu wananilipia sijui ni eda maju wapi, ama ni amwe ni toke, I'll just leave this country for good. Patriotic na patriotism ni wewe. I don't know what's about you. Comment down below and tell us your opinion. And the last one, men, he pressure ya kumeza enhancement drugs utoka wapi. <laughs> Aha, guy. Isa na sana inakuwa na watu waze, eh, wanaume waze, wababas. Kwa sababu ile hali ya, ya, ya uze pia na ile kutumia more, more drugs, zile like, like alcohol, alcoholism and those stuffs, and you have some pressure ya perform. Hmm? 
so unaamua upiga kachum chum hivi kunywa ka blue pill mambo itemke ndio yule mrembo pia ku accelerate but unfortunately that should not be the case kwa sababu the way our good lord created us a man should have power in a day in a time anyhow so i don't think uh, kuna haja ya kutumia hizo ma blue pills hizo ma uh, zinaita kwaje kukumaga whatever na mukombero hizo <laughs> vitu na kinajuku karaga sijui ni za nini mnatumia uh, when you get to a real man like me anakuchapia 2 hours bila kurudi nyuma 2 hours 2 hours ladies can you imagine 2 hours what it can do for you 2 hours <laughs> so wanaume hii pressure inatokaga mostly kwa eh, pressure ya kuperform unataka huu mrembo pia ku salute so what do you think guys give us your opinion tuambie wewe unafikiria aje kwa hizo maswali kadhaa tumeulizana what's your opinion so asante sana let's meet in the next video